Enseek is meant to be one of the hardest 44 challenges. To recap, it starts in 1945, about a month or so before Germany is about to surrender. So you're pretty much meant to lose and almost guaranteed. Now I'm not the best Hoi 4 player and some might call me the worst Hoi 4 player, but somehow by divine providence or I, I don't even have an explanation for it, I've managed to stall the front and even push a little bit. Today I'm going to do the impossible, or at least what I thought was impossible. Today I'm going to win Enseek. Yeah, it turns out a lot harder to push against an enemy who has supply. <laughs> who knew? So what do we have? We have medium tanks and we have trucks. We have mechanized. So I'm going to make a new division here. So 20 width. Instead of a field hostel, we are going to get support anti-air. Yeah, I just deleted that, didn't I? <laughs> How am I, like, somewhat winning? <laughs> I'm going to call this the test tank. And a lot more medium SP artillery. Is there anywhere I could get chromium? Oriental Republic of Uruguay. I don't know. We don't have any convoys, so... Oh, Sweden. Sweet. Check out the infantry equipment. So what are you missing? Armored car. Yeah, we're going to get rid of the armor. Uh, Panzer twos, right? Yeah, armored car. They're basically the same thing. They both have wheels, right? Should fix that problem, right? That's an attack across all fronts. Oh my god. Yeah, everywhere's fighting. Christ. The hell triggered that? Why is the fighting strength? Okay, 93%. What the hell triggered this? Okay, we're holding in most areas, I think. Oh, no. We are no longer... We, we've got pushed back here. Okay, that's fine. That's fine. Just don't lose anything major. Okay, let's uh, shorten this front line. I was going to, like, go for the bottleneck there, but frankly, let's focus on yeah, shoring things up. Christ. Not missing anything, am I? Nope. <laughs> Ooh, you run out of supply. Naval invasion where... Oh boy. Ah, same location as always. <laughs> I've learned. Oh boy. That's that's rough. Okay, we're probably going to get pushed back in a couple of places. Okay, I really don't want to drain supply anywhere, so I'm going to go over to Berlin. You don't push me back, have you? <gasps> supply is so bad here. No convoys have access to supply fulfillment. Don't try and use convoys. <laughs> oh boy. All right, we got pushed back. That's okay. That's okay. That's okay. That's okay. It sucks because it's a fort, but like, let's not kill ourselves over it like I'm doing right now. I'm gonna go take Rotterdam for the supply. Uh, I was going for an encirclement, but I don't think that's possible. There we go. That fixes our supply issues over here. Mm, I don't like this. No, we need, to, we need to keep Leipzig. I'm sending the tanks. Okay, we've held Leipzig and given them a chance to entrench. Let's get the tanks out of there before they drink all of the supply. Now, I should be able to push into these two provinces. Hold that. Okay, I messed up. Uh, I actually got encircled there and then immediately got uh, immediately counter encircled. That's good. Pin that. Okay, perfect. That's a nice encirclement. We lost the problems we've held since the start. Which just kind of sucks. The, the other concern I have is I don't want to take too much coastline. Yeah, look, you can see how much of a stuff I've just stolen from other people. Um, I'm going to get 10. So, the, yeah, the issue is coastline. <laughs> Big issue of mine is coastline. Because the more we take, the more we actually have to, you know, hold. So why I want to start moving around here a little bit. Um, and I want to take this place. Another attack on my person. Jesus Christ, that Hamburg's a... I think I, it was like a tank or something there. I should have disabled the forts. But taking this province isn't going to help. I need to go down the railway line. So, Nuremberg. That's our next play. Ooh, you have absolutely nothing. Okay. Small encirclements. See what order of the day. Come on. Oh, chaps, please. Push. Nice. Nice, okay. That's one step. Very necessary one. Uh, don't lose that. Oh, I didn't actually finish you guys. Alright, I, I want to look at the casualties. Damn, you are holding. And there's artillery equipment. I'm going to update these when we have, have got enough supply. Okay, we are just, like, there's so much infantry equipment we have. I'd love to just spam them on the front line, but, like, the, the supply situation is, is not, not good. This is forest, so I don't really want to put tanks in here. Plus, you know. Supply. Come on. Just push into Frankfurt now. Nice. Uh, and as we do this, we're getting back our factories, which is good. Okay, I'm going to get a modern tank chassis, and we're going to start maybe looking at building some new tanks. What are we lacking? SP artillery. Once we wipe this lot, we'll look at casualties. Right. Indian operative captive. Capturing everyone. Okay, where are you landing? There. It's fine. Seems like a weird place to land. Ooh, they, they push me? 
think they did. I do want to take this back. See if we can. Yep, cool. We did not. Uh, we might be taking it back. I don't know. I think we did take it back. We'll, hold, we'll see if we can hold it. Okay. Casualty stats. We've probably lost some mil by now. Oh, 1.5 million. 1.5 million. The Allies have lost 1.5 million. And the Soviet Union has lost 11 million. <laughs> what are your laws looking like now? Manpower-wise, you've got barely anything. You're also running out. Soviet Union, I'm not. <laughs> Did you have no, no clue what the Soviets are doing? Okay, I want to try and swing up into, into Ghent. 301, 115 versus this lot. Like, these tanks should be better. You know what? Let's, uh, we're going to order a, an immediate test of the weapon. Right. Run out of medium tank destroyers. Wait, what? Why do I have medium tank destroyers? Did I put them accidentally put them in here? Apparently, yeah, apparently I've got a tank destroyer in here. Sure, yeah, okay. Yeah, this one province is not getting any supply. Right now. Will I get supply now? Either we surrender it or we uh, counter. Uh, I want to get an agency. This might screw me over a little bit in the short term. But long term, we need supplies. So we go from here into Namur and then up. That's the plan. Let's see. We are breaking them. Ish. Not really. Mm, yeah, it's not really worth it. Okay. The tanks have failed me initially. Ah, oh, Christ again. It's the Turks. Why, why are the Turks here? Nationalist Spain joins the Axis. Please. Yeah, his tanks really are not all that. I should probably get better tanks. Okay, cool. We've got an agency now. Oh, we have no trains. Oh, my God. We have no trains. Should have kept an eye on the trains. Let's go here. See if we can't push a little bit. Come on, there we go. Oh boy, I mean, it's it's a grind for sure. It's certainly a grind. Let's see if I can touch this now. Okay, it looks like we're going to break through. Come on. Come on. Nice. Straight to Brussels. Pin him. Pin him all. Okay, I think we're going to trap him here. Yeah, we do. Excellent, let's finish him off. Tell you what, the Turkish troops are good. That's the, that's the, that's the thing I'm shocked most by. Like, if I see a Turkish flag... I'm concerned. Don't let him push you past that, please. This man, I don't know who he belongs to, but he is, I mean, he is determined to keep attacking. Right, that's why. Like, he's, like, bled himself to do that. <laughs> I need to push him out of Antwerp. Where? Okay. Hey, we finally fixed the supply in Leipzig, but I still keep pushing it. There we go. Finish off those troops, please. There we go. All right, we're going to hand this lot over to this guy. See if we can't push round to Dunkirk. I think the tanks can probably help with that. They immediately left again. Like, don't do that. Oh my god, we're actually gonna go. Nice. The only reason I did that is because these guys really want to defend this port um, from the garrison order. I don't know why they want to so badly, but they do. Okay, can't let these guys survive. Where are they coming in? Northern France. Benelux. There we go. Okay. Running out of supplies, anything? Trains, mostly, but we're building those. Building convoys, I think, was a pretty good idea. Might as well take them out of Calais. Literally no downside. And I think I'm not going to push um, any more on the ports, like on the uh, on the coastline. I think it's a bad idea. Yeah, we have no idea what the Soviets are up to. Like, at all. Oh, Turkish troops. We've got to get rid of those. Ooh, he's retreating the wrong way. That's not what you want to see. Well, it's what we want to see, to be fair. Don't let the Turkish troops out, please. Right, we have just uh, a couple of chaps that have turned up because they have gone in. Uh, we're still running out of early train equipment, apparently. And trains. Okay. And it's 14 divisions stacked up on one point. All right. Well, keep on these little pointless displays. I don't know why you're doing it, but sure. We go in here because it's a good promise to take. And if possible, let's see if we can take out the Turkish troops. It's, it's a big ask. They are Turkish. They've given me so much trouble. So I'm seeing their tanks and like, uh, so I'm seeing their infantry in here and I'm just like, I have to go for them. I'm on a campaign. If you're watching this and you're, you're Turkish, I mean, well, fair play, chaps. Oh, they did take that province. Okay. North of Leipzig. It's unfortunate. Um, let's see if we can take it back. Or at least surround some... Oh, look, there you go. Look, spearheaded by the Turks. Take out Namur. Uh, yeah, we'll, we'll push into this province as well. Just a bunch of provinces... Just a bunch of uh, troops, including some uh, tank here. So let's go for that. Oh, they're mass assaulting. They wanted to get back the Turkish troops. Understandable, really. If it wasn't for the Turks right now, <laughs> my God, we'd be in Moscow and Paris. It's a Turkish heavy tank. I, I feel like I'm stretching my lines a bit thin here. 
Yeah, I, I don't, I don't want to. Uh, well, we'll try with the tanks. Oh my god, they're actually pushing something. This is a miracle. All right, finish this lot off. Ooh, that's bad. See that? This is this is my concern. Whew. Uh, I'm actually gonna chuck even more men on the defense front. Another ten. I feel like that's a good idea. All right, it's time to use our old tanks as well. We're still running out of. Uh, okay, we're still running out of trains. Uh, tank stuff. All tanks are good. Yeah, still loads of trains we need. I can put a dent in it. I think what I'm going to do is like go there. So you lot are going to go here. You lot are going to go here. Don't let them out. Where's that naval invasion? Over here. We <laughs> can't get these. You can't dislodge these uh, British troops. Idiots. Why was there not a man on the port? Why? 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 I watched that happen. I was like, surely, surely we'll defend that, right? God. Now I'm not microing this front. This could be an absolute disaster here. Um... Oh, Jesus, I tanks to pull off. I've got, I've got you lot, I guess. Where are my other tanks? Why are you just sitting there? Get out of there. Dude, just keep hammering and we need these ports back. Oh, we got the encirclement. That's nice. Uh, that's such little supply everywhere now. No, 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 no. Go and attack them. Okay, before they flood men in here, please. I know you're losing the fights, but like, just come on. I don't fight all this to lose a British naval invasion. You still can't beat them, can you? Okay. Where now? Targeting? I don't care if they're targeting here. Dash of Spade isn't in the war. Are they? Yeah, they wouldn't help. Request garrison support. <laughs> They'll give us 56,000 manpower, though. This is a mess of a defense right now. Please go. Okay. All right. We're defending the north, but... Uh, yeah, supply situation down south is leaving a lot to be desired. They pushed us, 100% they pushed us here. I need to take this province, uh, so we need to start tracing the railways. Okay. I'm gonna stretch you guys out, and you are just gonna sit there, that's your entire job. Alright, let's finish off this lot. Just, no, no, look, you go and attack Vlander, please! <laughs> we need to clear him out of here! <laughs> Shout out to the British in Dunkirk, refusing to surrender. Or near Dunkirk. Okay, so we need to get to here. To do that, we have to break through a mountain. Okay, we're going to push around here and see what we can do. Please, just go away! Why are you not dying? Come on. Come on, chaps. You got this. Just push through a little bit further. Uh, you lot need to pin that, please. I, I, am I, like, hearing things? I swear I could have heard the... Uh, I thought I had the naval invasion sound. Nice. Okay. Go there. Go there. Please just stop. I just can't kill him. There we go. Okay, that's, that's a good amount. Killed. I'm going to pull out my tanks, give this guy some supply. Ooh, that's an opportunity. Is it? Jesus Christ, no it wasn't. I've just given up territory. Stop. Oh my God, that was horrifying. I thought my walls should go up as well. Oh, that was bad. That was so bad. Yeah, I've screwed the defense of this entire place. Um, Try and get it back, I guess. Okay. It's the Turkish troops. Look, they're just holding. Still haven't dealt with these guys. They just refuse to die. Oh, that's a mass assault. I don't know that we won't get pushed back here. Yeah, we are going to get pushed back. Oh my god, finally we got rid of them. Okay. Oh god. It feels like it, it gets harder the more I push out. Like, just scrambling to get static. Like, sure. Uh, that was... We, like, we did that. That's okay. But the rest of it is just... Ugh. We're getting pushed back off of here. But we'll take that. Very much like two steps forward, one step back vibe. And now they're all a little bit consolidated to the point where I'm nervous about pushing anything. Okay, so we need to push this to get Nuremberg, right? Nuremberg's now going to be our, our priority. Okay, we've taken this. Oh my god, Nuremberg's actually just open. That's great, because that's going to cut supply over here. Oh, you don't let this... You do not let this slip. Yeah, he's gone. Oh, that's a shame. I mean, I could try and poke it back, I guess. But yeah, I don't think, I don't think we're getting that. Where? Where I heard the naval invasion sound. Pushing so hard for Nuremberg here. I don't think I think it's a mistake. I think it's a mistake. Alright, we're not doing it. Ooh, they're gonna push it back now, probably. It's tile north of Leipzig, man. They they love it. They want it so badly. Nah, don't let that fall. Yeah, look, they've all got supplies over here, whereas previously they were dying. The Soviets are still dying over here, but I don't want to extend this front. I think that would be bad. Maybe if I hmm, this is dangerous thinking. I'm gonna try and break the road line. Right, I'm going for it. I'm going for a big encirclement here. Okay, that's a good encirclement. I don't know if it was worth it. Okay, we're going to try and go for the river line. Uh, sorry, the uh, the port there. I mean, we killed a lot of divisions there. I just 
that off, it was worth it. Ooh, actually, I kind of want to go for Danzig. We're going for it. We killed, I mean, we killed the entire front line here, so we have some leeway. Because, I mean, that's, those are railways upon railways, you know? Yeah, they've got supply over here in, uh, in Danzig. That's why I need to take it. It's another encirclement. Uh, do we just, I mean, let, let's shorten the front line by just doing this. Let's get the, this is, I mean, it's, I don't like what I'm doing. To be clear, I'm not happy with what I'm doing. I think this is a mistake, but I can't resist. Uh, I might have got myself encircled here. We'll see. I don't know. Oh, no, we've encircled them. Cool. I mean, yes, the plan all along. Because this front, like, the reason I'm not celebrating wildly is this front was always going to break. Um, this wasn't the front I was concerned about uh, at any point. Uh, my concern is that, look, their supply is now starting to come back. So I've, I've traded a front line for one that I think that they can push on. And that might have been a mistake. I should have, um, maybe it would have been a better idea for me to capitulate France first. Um, but the reason I did this, you might be thinking, okay, like, well, why'd you do this then if it was such a bad idea? I need to sort out, like, this front line because we're kind of massively overstretched here. They've pushed into Weimar. And they've taken Leipzig back. Oh, this is bad. Start pushing here. I've got 10 divisions up here that I don't know what to do with. So we are just going to line the coast with them for now. Uh, get the maximum amount of supplies I can. Until I've, I'm ready to push or do something. We have to take this province because uh, it's the one that connects to the hubs. It's going to be a painful push. Yeah, they've taken this opportunity to push quite far, actually. And, uh, yeah, we're, we're extended massively. Ugh. I'm not using my tanks intelligently at all. I don't even know where they are. Of course, it was the Turks spearheading the attack. All right, we're going to take back Dresden. <laughs> the Turks have even navally invaded me. Weimar's quite a crucial province. Let's take that back. The way to Nuremberg is a little bit open. All right, we're going to grind a little bit here. It's going to be painful, but I'm going to push and try and take some of these uh, provinces uh, ahead of the river line. Nope. No, 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 no. No, look who it is. It's the Turks. Taking Lubeck. We have no anti-tank. Christ, okay. That'll be why we've stalled. I need to get them out of the mountains, man. Like, I know I don't have any supply, and I know I don't have any resources, but we really need to push them past the mountain. Uh, go to a port. A couple of the supply again. I'm kind of surprised we don't have any supply here, given, you know, Danzig. Push the Turks off the mountains. Uh, get the French off as well. Okay. This should give us a nice place to hold once we get supplies back. They push us quite far back up here. But we've still not gotten rid of the Yugoloth. Why are you leaving Nate? Go back in and fight him. Atomic bombing of Holland. <laughs> oh, Christ. They got nukes. You're in bad shape here. Huh? My determination to take the mountains is, uh, has cost us. Okay, stop, 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 stop. stop. Like, let's not... I didn't get this far by being stupid. Well, actually. All right, let's get, our, let's get our supplies back. Okay, at least we have supplies now. We're winning on all fronts apart from that one. And we're about to keep the Turks out. Whew. Okay. Good stuff. Now, let's weather this attack. Against who? Oh. <laughs> Japan. <laughs> That's where they were. Trying to take a bunch of territory. And also, the Kingdom of Portugal has taken land. It's fun. Okay, it's calmed down. Mad push there. We've got 2.47 million casualties, but the Soviets have lost 11 million. We've killed 20 million from them. The French have lost 4.71. Turkey has lost 1.1 million. The UK has lost 1.1 million. Right. They have 5 to 6 million manpower left. This lot of uh, 8.5k. Okay. Right. I think... I think now what I'm going to do is reshuffle some things around. And okay, the tanks didn't really work, so let's stop producing those. We have four more tanks, but like, I've never really done anything. Okay, the Turks are back. Right, I want to rejig this. It's going to be a scary moment. Right, I want this front line to start from here and go all the way up here. And we'll double up on Prague. Okay, they're attacking us as we're moving troops around. This was inevitable, really. Let's see if we can hold Breslau, though. Ideally, I would. I don't know if we can. We'll, well, I mean, we'll bloody try. Oh, I don't know what to do. All right, let's let everyone get settled. Oh, my God. Or not. All right, let's change around our armies a little bit. Instead of attrition, we go for entrenchment speed. All right, it's a mad rush from them. This is a, a very risky place to be. Okay, I've got to decide on a, on, on a course of action. I think we're going to try and capitulate the French. So with that in mind, let's start pushing. Because the survey is going to take so long, so... Okay, the Chinese are now fighting. Fantastic. The boys in Breslau are all good. I'm so glad that I just randomly had two tanks in Stettin. Alright, we're going to transfer our, our lads over to this front. 
our tanks and see if we can't push through somewhere. We need to take Luxembourg. I don't know how likely that is, but we do need to take it. Uh, this makes me nervous when the Soviets mass assault. Ooh, do not let him out. Even if it's one division. Even if it's one division, we'll still finish the encirclement. All right, we have still not got, a, we've still got deficit events. I gotta be way more careful about that stuff in the future. So this will give us factories going South Germany. But yeah, we're, we're too away from Paris, man. We're just gonna go for it. There we go, we take a Paris. Fall of Paris. Ugh. German troops recreated the, the victory parade of 1871. Uh, yeah, I think we're a bit beyond that. So that is going to help supply a lot, and we can push this province here. I just don't really want to get... It's just constant attacks. I can't be everywhere at once. The Soviets are suffering from supply issues on the eastern front. That's ideal. We've got resistance because we're actually pushing into territory that we don't call. What was that? Northwest Germany. Naval, uh, naval issues. Who do you belong to? No one, I assume. Yeah. Pretty sure we have more men blockading our ports than we do actually fighting. Okay, we're gonna encircle a Soviet division here and a French one. Just try to extend out the, the front line as much as possible so we don't get encircled in Paris. Whew. Wherever there are Soviet troops, there are weaknesses because they are very poorly equipped. So I'm just trying to use the, what I have there to bully them. Oh dear. Appear to be encircled. Okay, unencircle ourselves, please. As soon as you can, chaps. Thank you. I've become disillusioned with my tank divisions. They are just sort of drinking supply. Yeah, we've got pushed back here. Oh, another naval invasion. Right, I've got to think a sec. Oh, <laughs> I see, it's, it's on the fins. Um, how best to proceed? Okay, so the east we're just holding now. I think we just need to go for tiny little circums like this. Okay, that's actually terrible. I, I thought we were pushing into a province with parachuters uh, that had full infantry division. Right, push the river line, please. Thank you. And supply marches onwards. Anything? I'm just scanning the front line for anything I can I can take advantage of. Shift you lot over to this front. Try and get some firepower over here. Can, can you get this? No? Try. No. Bloody Turkish troops. They're really good. Bit a bit of a stalemate here. Yeah, I can't push past like I used to. I used to be able to just like right click and delete. I'm spread a bit thin. I might take some troops. I'm taking. I'm taking. They've just bombed Brussels. <laughs> There's a nuke on Brussels. <laughs> Why? Uh, I mean, I'll push on the Soviet front where appropriate, like here. Just need to push these guys out. Sweet. Then I can kill eight Soviet divisions here. Need to take these three problems. We really do. Okay. Uh, let's see if we can push here. Okay, we can. There we go. Uh, and can... Does that give us the opportunity to take this province? Please do it. Oh. I think so. Not now. Nice. Okay, that's a big. That's that's a massive take. You keep the, 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 I feel bad for the Turks. They keep on invading where I just have tanks. All right, that's fixed our supply in this region. Uh, Luxembourg doesn't have any forts. Can we take it? Maybe. Put the pressure on a little bit. There's a chance. Uh, are they moving out? It looks like they are. Let's see. Or at least a couple of them are. Come on. Come on. Yes. Nice. Okay. That's big. Taking Luxembourg. Just, come on, push it to this province. We could do that. We could do that easy. Come on. Come on. Nice. Go on, help that now. The invasion over here. It's fine. We actually have loads of troops to deal with those now. Okay. Encirclement done. Very nice. Oh, not going to be able to tell the province? I thought we would be able to. No? Okay. We'll just push across here then, and we'll finish off these French troops. All right. Uh, I think next plan, yeah, I, I've, I've been messing around over here. The next plan is fully to take the French. Oh god. Supply should sort itself out here in a bit. Oh, they tried to attack Paris? I think they did. Yeah, we're not getting through that. <laughs> there are level 4 trenches here. Oh god, it's about to turn into World War 1 over here. Uh, push past this, though. I want to do something bold here. This could be a horrible mistake. No, no, you know what? Every like, I think about it for like a split second. Right? Because I want to just right click and go, woo, straight. But then I think about it for like half a second. I'm like, actually, that's a terrible, terrible plan. Let's not do that. Uh, it's the level 4 trench here. Yeah, no. Stop it, later. <laughs> I just think I, if I right click it hard enough, you know? All right, let's try something. Oh, my God. They just bombed Paris. Dude, they nuked Paris. Jesus Christ. They have exhausted a lot of resources on just a random push, though. So, I mean, now's our time to push. Okay, we're counter-pushing very nicely. See if this actually comes, if anything comes of this, though. 
<laughs> the guys who got nuked in Paris haven't recovered. Sort of understandably. Yeah, I need to upgrade these tank divisions. They are it's really bad. <laughs> They're quick at getting places. That's about it. What's Champagne got? Forts and trenches? No. It's, that's not happening. I'm gonna have to go around the match. I swear we've been here before. <laughs> Oh my, uh, I did not know that that was that weak. Okay, cool. Just a French heavy tank we can go and surround. Well, at least imagine that was not. Yet. Well, not that it's uh, full glory. Let's see if we can take champagne. It'd be cool if we could. Oh, there's two champagnes. Which one's the dangerous one? I think, I think I'm think i taking the easy one. They're both the dangerous ones. I want to take this because now I can take this province. It has a fort on it. Okay, things have settled down a bit. All right. Can I push you off of this? No, the heavy tanks, I think. Let me see. Can, I can penetrate the heavy tank, right? Though I can pierce it, right? Yeah, okay. Not terrible. I just keep throwing men at that. Nothing's happened on the... Yeah, okay, cool. Nothing's happened on this front. Good. I'm gonna, just going to see if I can force attack into... Not actually force attack, but, you know, like, charge in here. Nope. We've just killed all our men. And lost the province. So, all in all, not great. I've been circle this lot, I think. Yeah, now, now they're the ones with the supply. And the game's crashed. Okay. <laughs> okay, so situation is pretty bad. Uh, 1949. We do have a lot of equipment, though. Uh, Casualties-wise, we are sitting at 3.17 million to the Allies, 2 million. But the Soviet still comment on 22 million. <laughs> Killed 5 million in the French Republic. Christ. So he has 4 to 5 million manpower that... Soviet Yugoslavia has barely anything left. The French have a mill. All right, let's just finish this lot off. Naval invasion. Half our resources go to sorting out naval invasions. Ooh, that's bad. That's a bad place to be navally invaded. Because if he pushes as well, we're in trouble. All right, cool. We're good. We fixed it. All right, let's see if these tanks can, can do something useful. Because right now, all they generally do is suck out the supplier places. So this is uh, half the issue I'm having now is the constant crashes. All right, now, now we try this again. <laughs> yeah, a weird suspicion. Why did I do anything differently? I knew this naval invasion was coming and I did nothing differently. I'll be honest, I have no idea why, uh, why this lot don't have supply. We're getting penalties because we don't have the territories. So let's try taking the territories. Come on, just, just disappear. Thank you. All right, that hopefully fix our supply issues. Maybe? So it's the 25th of June, I think, that keeps collapsing. Well, let's uh, let's see if, if I'm able to play past this point. Or if it's a TKO from the AI. I I, I think that counts as a... As, you know how, like, in um, boxing or MMA, they have, like, a doctor's stoppage? I think this counts as a doctor's stoppage. If, like, in my favor. So we're back here. Wait. <laughs> Again! <laughs> I knew it was happening and I didn't do anything to stop it. Poor guy's in Paris, man. They just got nuked. I, I, I'm not gonna lie. I respect the fact that they were willing to nuke the capital of France. You got to know that the, uh, the the British guy in the back was like, "Yeah, yeah no, it's a great tactical decision." The French are like, D "Dude, <laughs> you're not nuking Paris." And London's like, "Look, do you want to win the war?" All right, a lot of supply stuffs fixed here. If I could take Metz, that'd be great. Okay, I'm gonna try and push through here. This, I'm gonna I'm gonna do a big push to Nancy if possible. This is gonna suck. I really don't want to get bogged down by uh, the reverse Maginot. I don't know what it's called, the Ost Wall or something. I didn't check what day it was! <laughs> At least that's like a save this time. I think, I, th oh, I think something bad's happening to the game. <sighs> right, big push for Nancy. Yeah, they already have troops here. Okay, keep an eye out. I think I'm going to make a save now. I think it's the 25th. Okay, let's see, 24th. Okay, 1700 on the 24th. Something happened there. I was called into something. We're gonna have to deduce it. We're now fighting the game itself. All right, let's keep an eye out. 22nd, 23rd. All right, save the game. Here we go. So far, so good. So, Jibé Commune declared on the Marklik. Is that what crashes it? Oh, we survived a little bit. Maybe the game was just running too fast? I, pff, I don't know. Well, that cost me some progress. I was, oh, I was just about to over on the French. The second I increase the speed, 7th of June. Okay, right. I'll be back when I figure this out. I'm going to switch the AI. Uh, so the Shibe Commune declares war on the Mark Leak. So turning the AI off did mean we go past. <laughs> it's still troubleshooting. So make a save here. Turn the AI back on. And then it crashes. The AI does something. The AI does something. <laughs> so what we're going to do is we are going to turn off the AI. We'll see if that helps. Who the hell are they? 
Does so GBA coin mean declare one of the mark click? I think that's what's bugging. Okay, we're gonna do. The reason I'm showing this is because like, I I really I've tried really hard to, to win this like legit. So I want to show you what changes I'm making so that people don't accuse me of cheating. And I was stupid, but I'm really proud of this. All right, uh, tag XSM. All right, and we're gonna annex. We're gonna annex this thing. Zero four. Tag Germany. Okay. I think that worked. Okay, cool. We're back on. We're back on. Save the game. All right. Brilliant. <laughs> now. Oh, where was I? I need these two provinces. I thought it went first of July. I thought it I thought the game crashed now. Okay, we're good. Uh, they look like they're trying to push out of champagne. I'm okay with that. You leave champagne by all means. I'll just push them out of here real quick. Just then we have a province free. And do you think we can push them out of champagne? Maybe? I mean, I'm looking at a lot of... Um, yeah, I think we could do that. We take, push them out of Mets. That's good. Go on. Tech Champagne. That's great because that's a five, level 5 4 we just push them out of. These guys aren't getting any supply. Which is weird because um, I have the full state. So why aren't you getting supply? There's no connection to the capital. Oh, God. There's a very tenuous one. Naval invasion somewhere. This is where... Okay, right. We need actually need to push in and take this province. This is the problem. This is the problem right here. Yeah, I can't take it either. Ugh. See, see the supply issues? It's this province. Oh, we can take it. Pin them. Come on. Don't give the province back after we've taken it. We had supply for a second. All right, we're getting naval invaded. We're blocking that. That's fine. How's everything on the eastern front? It, weirdly enough, you'd love to be on the eastern front. The western front is an absolute grime. The eastern front, I mean, if you're a German soldier, you, you barely saw action. The only action they've seen is like me swinging in and like destroying about two million soldiers, then leaving. Supplies a little better, but it's not great. Maybe we can push them out of it. Oh, this would be big. Oh, this could be huge. Come on, Nancy. Yes. Okay, we took Nancy. Pin that. Oh, no. They're just going to take that. I mean, they could take that random province. That's fine. Just want supply, man. Why do you not have supply? No supply connection from capital. Why not? Like, is it because of Dunkirk? That'd be weird. Oh, no. Okay, they're gone. Good. Yeah, we're going to have a rough time of it. Okay, why? I've got to fix the supply. Like, desperately. Why? Oh, no! Oh, this is bad. This is so bad. This is so, so bad. Yeah, screw the supply situation. This is way more pressing. Okay, we're taking Hamburg. Jesus Christ, that could have been terrifying. Okay. So, like, this has supply connection to the capital. Why do you not? Okay, you do now? What changed? You still don't. I think I fixed the supply. Maybe? Oh, that's also why. I kind of got to take some territory here. Where's that naval invasion now? <laughs> I'm tired. Okay. You don't have any defenses, so we're just going to see. In fact, let you walk past. the. In fact, let you walk past. Oh, they're attacking me. Please win one of those. You're not going to win either of those, are you? Just suddenly out of supply. I don't... This is... Pff, what? Do not for the life of me understand why sometimes we're in supply, sometimes not. Like, you're bringing supply from over here, which obviously is getting, like, sunk. I understand that, but, like... Maybe I just need to connect these two. Let's try that. I'm going to get this tank out of here. You need to fix your supply. And I think it's also the, the penalty is going to be scaled because this state, whole state thing here. We need to open up a second or a second province to attack. It's just not going to happen. You know what? Look, look. Let's, let's stop it. Just wait until you have the, the resources. Did they just nuke Amsterdam? But why? God, they're so nuke happy. That kind of scares me. Okay, what do I currently have in my... So I've got engineer company. Maybe. I can invite Japan to... They're going around too. They're democratic as well. That's amazing. Uh, okay. Switch out some research. I'm hoping this helps with the supply. I've connected up these railways. I think that has, actually. I think I've just fixed the supply. Oh my god, I, di I did. Kind of. Where's that naval division? I've just got tank divisions around the place. That's the good thing about these tank divisions. They, they, are, they are decent at, like, sending back this lot. Of, from naval invasions. They're terrible at pushing their own because of the amount of supply it takes. Wait, you're neutral. Oh my god, you're neutral. We are like... I mean... Pff, we could split this... I don't really want to flip, split the front line in two because that might make things complicated and I don't do complicated situations very well. Alright, wherever we have supply, we're going to push. I feel that's a good idea. Getting rid of two of these divisions. Three, actually. Hopefully they retreat. Okay, cool. That's useful. We get rid of uh, some of... Was that Italian divisions? Uh, we took Nancy. But for some reason, everyone is leaving the front line. 
Why? Don't leave the front line. Don't do that. Right, British putting men in Sherberg. Let's take those guys out. Yeah, they've just left this the, the center of Germany. Why? Don't do that. Don't leave the center of Germany. Please. Oh my god, they left it all. Why? Jesus, why? Oh my god, all of my work is just being undone in front of my eyes. But, but I, it doesn't make sense. Why would you do this? Okay, maybe it was... Maybe the AI was like, hey, this dude needs more encirclements. Let's help out by leaving the front line and forcing encirclements. I mean, I appreciate it, but never do that again. No, they took Frankfurt. That's such an important hub. Dude, they... Oh my god. Look how far they pushed. We were at Nuremberg. Okay, we're gonna have to push them back over the river. This is gonna be painful. There are Americans here now as well. That's rough. But like, look at these like 12 divisions. I don't know, what are you, what are you doing? If I move them around. Yeah, there you go. If I move them around and they're suddenly trying to go to the front. They were just sitting there. Oh my god. I, the mountains. I had them pushed off the mountains. Oh man. This is gonna turn it. This, this has turned into bitter fighting. We've lost Nancy. Oh! <laughs> Like, half these guys are just standing here doing nothing. Oh, this is a nightmare. Oh, for God's sake. Ah, oh, well. I think it was just they, they did it to strengthen this front, which doesn't really make any sense. Uh, before I forget, let's grab this lot. And let's get them to defend northern Germany as well. There's if on cute. There's a the naval division. Oh, my God. I don't... I can't... I can't tell what's going on with the front lines. I don't want to move it in case I mess up. Okay, so... Stop deleting things too hard. Okay, so that's one front line. They shift us out of Reslau. Get that back. Do not let those men die. Fortunately, we have a lot of, like, out of combat support penalties, uh, the, uh, bonuses. Okay, we pushed over to more of the Atlantic. So that's fun. All right, we're going to go take Brest now. We'll try to. We are spread so thin. I'm going to need more men. I'm going to need more men. Uh, okay. Big push from the uh, Soviets there. That might screw with my supply lines. Uh, no, looking pretty good. We were at Breslau down here, and that was quite a good one because that starved all their troops. I don't know if we want to try and push and take it back, though. I kind of want to just focus on France and devote the resources there. All right, we're going to move this lot over to the eastern front. Merge those together. Uh, and we're going to ex extend the eastern front lot. Okay, we're going to extend the eastern front lot to cover the mountains over here. In fact, we're going to keep it as is. I'm sure we've... Well, I didn't expect that. Oh my god. Push them! They're just all trapped. Oh my... Oh, they are so trapped. Okay, right. Uh, this is going to be a mess for a while. Push every single one of them. There is the thinnest line all the way across the country. Uh, right, we're going to have to rush and try and... Could try and defend the south here. Um, oh, we could put some troops here. But that, 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 I don't know if that's such a good idea. But I could, I could that's kind of a large front line. Um, we'll, we'll leave things how they are. All right, Rhineland, deploy you lot. Go to this front immediately. I think we are just going to do our best to get these guys out of here. There's a lot of Soviet troops just, just died or are, are dying. Just push on every front. Right, we're going to slow this down. Let's get you lot over here. Area defense. Yeah, we moved to cut off the Soviets completely here. Uh, let's attempted. All right, let's let's actually make the tank core useful. Like, even if it costs us, like, supplies. Uh, go there. I'm trying to get the tanks together as soon as possible. If they were getting circled, they were getting circled, so. I think because that's surrender, yeah. Okay, I need loads of toad anti-air, yeah, but. Push! Push all of them. Make sure everyone is pushing. All right. All of you lot. Finish that off. Go, go, go. All these little pockets. Okay. Take them out. Awesome. Good stuff. Good to see. Pin them so then we get through. All right. That's another lot rinsed. Now, our front line is going to get incredibly messy. Just about trying to unmess as much of it as possible. Okay. Now we have like loads of different... Okay, let's start setting this up. Okay, I think we're going to extend this one all the way down here. We're going to give one of this lot over there. So they can spread out and at least hold the uh, assault a little bit. And that gives us four armies to deal with. Uh, four armies currently. I think I'm going to split them in two. 
one of you is going to go and deal with this front. The other one is going to deal with the Italian front here. Now, I'm making a big risk because I'm withdrawing off of this front, but I think it is worth it. All right, speed it up and get going. Like, the tanks are here just to slow the advance. Okay, we're taking Bordeaux. Oh, okay, past January. Every time the game stutters, I freak out. Yeah, it's a dangerous time whilst we readjust our front lines. Don't get me wrong, Fall of, Fall of France is amazing. <laughs> Didn't think I'd get this far. But there's also a couple of issues with it. Okay, there aren't any ports down here, so we're going to clean up these two pockets and then look at the, uh, the front over here. Right, about to clear up that pocket. Pocket here. Okay, we're somewhat... Somewhat... Uh... <laughs> Stabilizing the eastern front. Again, these are very messy times. I'm going to take poor supply on the chin until I can figure out what I'm doing. Naval invasion somewhere. Eastern Germany. Should be fine. I think. So if it's a hold up in the last province here. I'm going to check the casualty reports after this, obviously. Okay. You lot. Who are you? What front do you belong to? That was the wrong, uh, wrong army to split. Okay. That's on me. That, I was wondering why things kind of collapsed in the east a little bit more than I was expecting. You go on that side. You are to go on that side. Go. Okay, I want to take as many of these forts as possible. Okay, I think things are stabilizing. Ish. The elusive ish. Right, I think one of this lot is suited to police work. I don't know which it is. Yeah, it's the Seicherung divisions. Uh, looks like the resistance actually... Yeah, it's increasing a lot. I want to check on martial law is the default. See if that starts. Yeah, okay. That's starting to crack down on things. Okay, now we need to pull all of the tanks out. <laughs> there is another benefit to uh, taking on this territory as well. It's that... <laughs> it's that the Allies now have to split their air force. Okay, so with that pocket destroyed, the Soviets have taken 20 million in casualties. We've taken 3 million. The Allies have taken 2.52. Uh, and the French took 5 million. <laughs> Or capitulated. You cannot have that many men. Yeah, we need to sort these supply connections and quickly. Oh, this is gonna be miserable. This is gonna be horrible, isn't it? I'm trying to get them to go places because they're just kind of standing around. Okay, looks like we're gonna encircle a bunch of divisions up here. Uh, oh, are we gonna encircle them? For a second, it looked like we were. We might. And we stop fighting them. Don't do that. Continue to fight them. Okay, still figuring out supply issues. Oh my god, supply here. Jesus Christ. I mean, we've got good supply pretty much everywhere. Uh, just apart from the front lines. Okay, you guys did your job well. Go and join this lot now. Okay. We've encircled them up here. That's a good amount of divisions actually we've encircled. And we have supply and they don't. Ideal. Okay, so where are we lacking in supply? Over here. There's supply connection from capital. I'm not sure why there's a railroad going right through it. Okay, now there is. Okay, so now they're suffering from a lot of lack of supply. And we are too... I'm going to have to build some stuff. Build a railway there. That should do us. So we have a lot more civilian factories. We've got zero war support. <laughs> Since people want this done, our stability is terrible. It's actually going down weekly support-wise. Okay. All right, now we've got to decide on our next target. That's where Mountaineers would be very useful. Where's that? Eastern Germany, Northern France. Should have men for it all. I think I need to deal with Italy first, because that's a nasty, like, we've got two mountain provinces to go through. I mean, they are lacking in supply over here, so I'm going to just go for it. Like this. Okay, we are going to cut off a couple of divisions over here. It takes so long to move here. Nice. Yeah, we're also running out of supplies. Um, hmm. How do we break through this front? We've got two choices. Either we go up from here, or we go from the north. Um... Neither one of those is looking particularly appetizing with, the, again, the sheer quantity of... Uh, I think what I'm going to do... We're going to build these railways. This is where an air force would be spectacular. <laughs> oh, that's amazing. Are you actually in this war? Nash Spain's in the war. Oh. I don't want you to be Who called you in? I don't want you to be in this war. You're going to swarm. Oh, God. The supply issues I'm going to have because of him. This is a bit of a stalemate. Actually, this front is, uh, has gone actually got supply now in the south at least we have a supply hub here it goes through here let's make that a little bit more efficient what the hell just happened he somehow took salzburg oh man i didn't even see this this is a whole front line okay we made it in 
That's good. All right, let's get this front, this northern front away. I think that might be able to help us. Okay, resistance is going down, kind of. Okay, we've got supply in the south here. Still haven't managed to take out this lot. Mountains are nasty. Do we have any mountaineers? Uh, let's get some. Do we need more troops? I don't know if more troops is really the solution. We could always make more troops. Uh, we can make 12 of these. Let's do it. Oh, they've actually got supply here as well now. Yeah, we definitely can't push that. Oh, the nasty fronts, this. Dude, can you stop nuking Brussels? <laughs> Why are you taking out Belgium so, like, haphazardly? All right, we're going to wait for these um, mountaineers, and then we'll try and push with them. Your researching nukes is incredibly hopeful. Because if I, I, if I can take this province, just this province, we are good. Let's see, am I able to push? Oh, yeah, absolutely. All right. Got the 12 divisions over here. This is going to get a little bit nasty. Because I'm going to have to... I'm going to shoehorn them in here. What the hell? How did they get out? Oh, I must have let them through. I've just killed that division, unfortunately. Where are my... Bosham Jaegers? What do you call the special ones? The... The other ones. Did they... Where did they go? They were just here. What? I just had them. They're still around somewhere. Oh, there they are. All right. Put them there. Delete that. And then you lot. What? what? Nope. Right. You are going there. And you lot have done a fine job, but it's time to go. And this front can just sort of sit there. So we can give our mountaineers a chance to breathe. Huh. Hello. Um, tank, tank force, go! This is bad. This is. I'm going to send a force in to help out the Spanish. I really don't want to, but I have to. I really, really don't want to. Oh, God. Uh, I just... Uh, why? I thought they could take out the Portuguese. I didn't, I didn't invite them to this war. I don't even want them to be here. Okay, we still have equipment, which is good. New theater. Okay, we're going to set this lot up on the border. So then worst case to worst. If worst comes to worst, they'll... Uh, we can hold somewhere that's a little bit more pleasant. All right, see what you can do. Are they leaving? I mean, absolutely leave the mountains, please. They are fully leaving. Why would you do this? What we could do to shore up this front line. Nasha Spain's not doing well. Ah, oh, it's the bloody Turks. They're back. And they got a lot of supply. Mountaineers are already as good as they can get. Just do this stuff then. There's way too many fronts here. Uh, there's too much to do. Oh, these are like well-trained troops. I, I might just give up the entirety of Spain. Oh, that's so irritating. How, Franco? How did you let this happen? I'm assuming even force something here. Okay, we are like, we're in Italy. But at, at what cost? Because there is no supply here. Oh, I just don't like looking at Spain. All right, I'm going to send two full armies. Two full armies to Spain. I'm just lucky that we stole all this equipment. <laughs> oh, man. Come on. Just keep pushing. Even if you don't want to, we got to get to a port or something. I'm just going to flood it and just see what happens, man. Like, we are going to get to Milan, I guess. Yeah, okay. This is... Everyone's going to starve. Speaking of everyone's starving, let's have a look at Spain! <laughs> Alright, the Soviets are mass assaulting. That's fine. So have all our equipment. That's also good. Right, I'm just going to hold over here until I can figure out what to do with Spain. <laughs> okay, forgot to garrison uh, Salzburg again. That's on me. It's my bad. God, this is horrible. You know what I'm going to do? I think I'm going to pull out of Italy, uh, northern Italy, and just leave the this lot behind. If I put a front line in here, have them spread around, and then pull everyone else out. Spain, why are you here? Go somewhere else. Leave. Oh, you guys were successful enough to take that. Hold that instead. Wait. I think... Can you get to that? No. Okay, so cool. Just just hold that. Right, let's see if we can get a railway connected up here. <laughs> you just... You're, you were a mistake. I should never... I let you into the faction because I thought... I, I don't know why I thought this. I thought that people would station troops on your border and I'd like... I'd be able to just take advantage of that. But now we're here doing this. These mountaineers are great though. They're very nifty. Yeah, that's not what you want to see, huh? I hate you, National of Spain. She just opened up another front for no reason. <sighs> I'm in the same situation that uh, the Soviets were in. I think I was a little bit better, though. I might be better off, like, trying to capitulate the Soviets at this point, to be honest. 
Okay. Uh, I'm gonna pull everyone out here that isn't a mountaineer. Okay, we're still not. It's not great supply, but it's it's not terrible. How many do we lose over here? Mm, like ten divisions or so, if that. Okay, and what's the supply situation? <laughs> not good. Like I'm not willing to give up these forts. If we took like one step back, it would be ideal. But I'm not gonna do that because I'm not giving up the forts. It's a proper stalemate. This just means we need to try and break it. Okay. I'm going to try and go this way around to try and get some supplies to my troops by chasing the, the uh, railway. Yeah, if they keep attacking that, we're going to have problems. So the Spanish front's fine. The Italian front is miserable. The Soviet front is stable. Let's see if I can... Ooh, that was... This is bad. This is bad. That's two mountain divisions gone. Uh, I am going to consolidate what I have and shuffle up here. Tell them to get out. Yeah, I can't. I just can't break through the mountains. It just isn't happening. Maybe this front could give it some welly. I don't know how, though. Well, I want to do something, so let's start pushing the Soviets. Because if I can swing around here, I've got another entrance into into good old Italy. Right, let's go take Prague. Come on, push this way. There are British troops to be taken. God, after playing this, I understand why everyone hates the Brits. There you go. That's an encirclement. Quite a nifty one at that. Do not let them into Prague, please. Just generally push. No, what are you doing? Push into the province, please. One misclick and the entire front collapses. I've got a whole new appreciation for Hoi 4 players. I can do this week in, week out. Christ. That's a nice encirclement as well. Satisfying, though. It's bloody satisfying when you get that off. But that's less satisfying. Doesn't give me any warnings, any audio warnings anymore. I think this is definitely bug because it's been saying 0% logistics fulfillment for a while. I have convoys. Um, and this trucks, it says needed 3,440 in stockpile zero. I think that's wrong because, you know, I have like 4,000 trucks in stockpile. All right, swing past the Soviets. Another encirclement on the way. All right, we're about to get back to Breslau as well, which is nice. Uh, and I'm thinking we're going to go, like, this front line is collapsing completely. Let's go for a sweeping thing over here. There's another encirclement. This is way more satisfying. Screw you, Italian front. I got a new friend. It's called the Soviet front. All right, just... Get rid of you lot, please. Thank you. Next. Uh, I'm going to go swing you this way. And then just generally this way. I like this because I can just sort of broadly click and it's always a green bubble. Have kind of self left themselves a little bit open here, but that's that's fine. They can walk in if they like. There's another encirclement. I think I'm going to push until the major river here because I want to, again, I need to swing back around at some point. Right, push this way, please. I accidentally got that encirclement. Oh, God. That's, that's not a fun encirclement for me. The boys keep pushing. <laughs> all right, so let me get reshuffled a little bit here. They're just fully pulling off all the fronts. Can't do that. My encirclements. <laughs> the issue is the front line's like pushing faster than I can encircle. <laughs> so I end up doing this and just encircling nothing. The parts where I'm like, hey, uh, pin that guy ends up just being, I'm going to shove him away. <laughs> for, a flip, for a very, very brief split second, I thought, why don't I invade the, <laughs> the Swiss to get another front line against the... Um, Italians, but then I'd be invading the Swiss and then also I'd have another mountainous front like that just never a good idea All right, you know what hold let's not do anything too stupid. Let's go to Lodz. Let's take Krakow Go over here. I don't want to do with these tanks. So ideally we oh god Ideally we managed to stop you Nice we do. All right pin that lot, please Excellent We're getting close to the point where I'd be comfortable swinging around. I want to push up to the Warsaw River though I cannot for the life remember what that river's called. Keep going around. All right, there's an encirclement. Oh, man. Can I just make a white piece with the Italians? But I don't want to fight them. Every time I look at that front, I feel physically ill. I'm just getting loads of tiny little encirclements. I'm not exactly sure why that was left open. Come on. Let's not get, in, like, encircled elsewhere. Oh, man. I mean, it feels like we're making progress, at least. Even if, realistically, uh, the Soviets going to be around for so long that we're not. <laughs> I gotta make sure to keep it below 365. Come on, squeeze the trap shut, please. Research Dora. I don't know why I'm just not gonna use her at all, but still, she's there. She's eager. Come on. Just go to sleep. Go to sleep. There we go. See, we have manpower. Oh my god, they stopped. <laughs> they just mute Brock. What nearby was that, Berno? They gotta stop doing that. To be fair, someone was going to push through it. Look, they, they've got a nuke, but they're still charging out of <laughs> legends of the game. Push onwards, chaps. 
I adjusted my templates uh, just to add like an actual bit of artillery in them. I feel like I don't know if that was a good idea or not. I I just did it. Oh, hello. Um, the hell? Did they nuke up here? I think they might have done. You know, just keep pushing, chaps, please. I know it's a slog. I know you don't want to be here. I'm talking to myself, not the, the people in the game. <laughs> I'm also talking to you, I guess. That should be another encirclement. There we go. That's a tank here as well. And some British troops. So we decrypted our ciphers. Bastards. I've actually almost liberated all of Germany. Well, let's make sure all this lot are now infantry experts. Oh, fortress buster, yes, please. So we need to take Vienna to get our supplies. Okay, I'll well, just check yourself at it. We're long past the point where uh, we have to do careful attacks. I mean, not really. I just, I'm just saying that we are. Yeah, this front's a lot more fun. <laughs> long open fields, secure supply lines. Ah, oh, way more fun. British Parliament debates intervention in Scandinavia. Mm, sure. Why can you never do your job? Oh, I was having so much fun. I just... This is, this is going to be a lot of problems now. A lot of them. Oh, that's going to unify the front. And they're going to have so much supply. Ah, oh, Dude, what are you doing? Oh, Jesus Christ. I've realized what I've done. Um, Yeah, the whole Spanish front thing. I accidentally... Took them off of the front line of the, oh, sorry, of the fallback order. Oh. All right, we need to stop this before it comes uh, a much bigger issue. So Marseille is the problem. We're going to have to push to Marseille. Oh, Jesus. All right, any other issues? I don't think so. Not for now, at least. Uh, let's deal with this. Uh, those are two good ports as well. This is a yeah, I think this is, this is properly screwed me over here. I don't know what to do. I don't know what to do. Got a tank over here. Look how many troops are in here now. Ah, oh, <laughs> there's nothing I can do about it. There really isn't. Like I have armies, but they're just not like they've got air. They've got everything. I really just have to hope they overextend. It's kind of hard to do in a pocket this small. I mean, the front line is getting smaller, technically. And then they keep on doing things like this and just leaving like Montpellier open. Go, 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 go. That's an opportunity. That's an opportunity. Pretty sure they just uh, deleted one of my units. God, what a mess of a front line. Why do you have such low strength? I don't understand. Is it because they keep throwing you in there to die over and over again? Oh, God. All right. Let's get set back up now. All right. I'm assigning 97 divisions to this guy. <sighs> All right. Back to more pleasant times. I'm thinking, how do I see line? Because <laughs> if I get the Brits out of here, let me steal, like... Oh my god, they're literally everywhere. Don't walk past them. Kill them. Okay, we have a fleet. Whether or not that fleet's enough to, you know, sea line, I would... I'd guess not. Yeah, if I just throw myself at it, there's a chance I land. And I'm very willing to take that chance if it means even, like, a 2% chance we knock out Britain. They have been... Like, the Soviets are just... They're just pure... Infantry and we've been knocking them out. Look, I can just do this. I'll do it right now. I can just click and then just delete their army. Like it's not even a problem. We have armor and everything else, and it's just so annoying. Right, I said I'd stop at the river, so let's just push to the river. There's literally not a damn thing they can do to stop us. No, oh, look, Portuguese troops. Anywhere the Soviets like are supported. Oh god. Once again. Nationalist Spain comes to bite me in the ass. If I get rid of Portugal somehow, but I can't push through all that. Look at the armor, man. I'm sorry. Where's my army? <laughs> Dude, what? Where did you go? Let's try and turn it into something positive by pushing in here. But dude, uh, what the hell? <laughs> where, why? Uh, what? I don't, understand, I, don't, I don't understand where they went. But there's still, like, no one's shuffling over here. Oh, the game's about to crash. Nope. Okay, we're good. I don't get it. We're doubling up. Look, we're pushing more men there. Why? Come over here. <laughs> uh, this also completely ruins my supply. And we are going to, like, encircle a bunch of them, I guess. But I don't know if it's worth this. Uh, that's that dealt with. For the most part. All right, let's do this. Uh, you guys going to go? or? Okay, that should... That's given us green air. Go. Why do we... Yeah, we are not getting naval supremacy. My god. I thought we could get it for a second, but um, no. Well, that failed. <laughs> huh. The Americans actually have no... Oh my god, the Americans have nothing here. 
They have uh, they have the a, a complete inability to fight back. They have no strength. Why not? We're gonna push over the mountains. Oh my god. They have nothing. Why don't they have anything? I'm not complaining. Could pin everything. Oh, what do I do here? Okay, I've got to think. Uh, I think I'm moving out. It's got to be this province, right? It's definitely the weakest. Okay, move out of here. Oh, it's so close to breaking through. <laughs> One province away. It's not happening, is it? Oh, for God's sake. How good are your troops? Mm, yep, still pretty good. Yeah, it's kind of rough. I thought for a second. I mean, they're, they're suffering from supply issues, so that's nice. But I thought. I thought. I mean, we're no longer suffering from supply issues, so that's great. I've clicked the uh, offensive button, and uh, yeah, we're just sprinting through now. I'm concerned about this territory, but yeah, we're not pushing to the river line. It's good to me. I should probably stop, but like, I have it. I have somewhat of an industry. I should probably stop building like actual aircraft. All right, New Year dawns. I'll poke this again. Nah, not quite. It's like it's weak enough to tempt me, but they're pretty entrenched. There's just nothing here. I want to take out the Brits so badly, man. Okay, we're going to try this. Probably needs to have at least 50 transport planes. It does. I haven't deployed yet. Uh, there we go. Right, this is my new plan. We're going to try and drop on Dover. So if I can get like a second of, uh, of supremacy, I'll be able to do it. Yeah, how does it feel to be trapped in the cool and pocket, huh? Huh? Don't feel good. Oh, losing slightly more supply over here. All right, uh, let's deploy everything we have. Literally everything. I'm, I'm literally sending out, like, by whatever they are, the biplanes. Go, 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 go. We got green air. We needed 70% over the Benelux region. That's gonna be harder. They've been bombing the here for a long time. They are bombing the hell out of us. Uh, I'm just gonna try and fight in the Benelux for a while. If we lose all our planes, we lose all our planes, you know? It's not even close. Our number, yeah, they're just constant forcing. Okay, so that didn't work. I don't know what the hell's happened here, but okay. I mean, I'll try and take Yugoslavia out. And brought back the Hungarians. Belgrade's been taken. Yeah, we are snaking a lot here, and I'd much rather not be doing that. Right, we're about to get a division killed here, but that's okay. i got to be ready for the fallout here. How close are they to capitulating? <laughs> not even close. <laughs> Save his life! I think we're going to... We should be able to take this. Yeah, Belgrade's done. There's Romania. That's not the... Name of the thing I was expecting to say there. And the front line split too. Ah! How close are they now? I mean, ish. He is a very weird. We actually have no one on this front line. Um, that's not great. I just really want to pitch like Yugoslavia. There we go. That's Yugoslavia done. Oh, you don't have any equipment anymore. Bulgaria's gone. Dude, the front line's so shot. It's ridiculous. They are all like running out of supply completely here though. So that's nice. Alright, don't let them run away, chaps. Come on. Trap them. Trap them. Thank you. There's literally no one here. Well, run down here then. I think Vienna's open, you know. I think it is. No, no, it's not. Oh, that's that's a decent amount encircled. Christ. They leave Vienna. Go, 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 go. Take Vienna. Yes. <laughs> that's another thing I've been wanting to do for a while. I keep on telling this guy to go over here and then he like panics and runs back. Okay, that's why. Uh, Albania's done. This is a lot of unit. This is good. There you go. So a large amount of units dead. Why you, the job's not done? Go back down there. Okay, if their strength is weakening, we're just gonna keep on like battering them until they submit. Right, I'll grab you two. Don't have enough command power to force that sad. There you go. Done. Oh. Alright, we've taken Istanbul. <sighs> Never actually finished off this pocket. Just finished cool landing these lads off. And that's them done. At least, like, Eastern Germany's not getting bombed to hell anymore. That's, that's nice. All right, start pushing in. Slowly but surely. Go. Make it happen. Make it happen. No? Okay. Understandable. All right. Grand push. Go. There's literally no one left. <laughs> There's none. Pushing it. Go. Nice. Unfortunately, the uh, offensive order uh, triggers this lot to attack as well. Um, I'm not going to stop them. I'm not pushing anywhere in Italy. It's just not happening. I mean, this lot getting taken, which is nice. Oh, hang on. Maybe. Maybe. Indeed. Go. Push. Go, boys. Venezia's open, please. That's an attack, but... These 
Let's kill that mountain has been the entire time. No, push. All of you, push the Venezia. Get the port, damn it. Yes. This, oh my god, it's actually happening. Oh my god. Okay, we have to do, just keep pushing. Give me garrison support, nice. Just flood across, lads. They can't stop all of us. We're going all the way to Rome. Oh my god. That's, that's a lot of troops here. Just, I mean, there's nothing behind them. Just keep going. Built a whole ass army for this. I just gotta hope that they don't, uh, like, immediately kill me with, like, tanks or something if they're... I am, I'm legit not even fighting them. I'm just running around them. Or trying to, at least. Alright, nice and suck on that. I think Rome's open, you know. Oh my god. Thank you. We've taken Rome. Come on, please. Keep going. Naval invasion. We've got, surely got units to deal with that. Why are you suddenly suffering from attrition? What happened? What, like, I don't... What changed? There's actually quite a few troops here. <laughs> Just go around them, boys. They are pushing out of Yugoslavia a little bit. How do they, how do they have more supply than me here? Oh, we are lacking in everything. Artillery and anti-tank. I wasn't paying attention to that. I'm still going to keep pushing, though. It's fine. I remember to take Crimea, because sometimes the AI gets a bit weird with that. Fall of Moscow. There you go. Uh, I've stopped the offensive because I think it's probably probably good idea. Let's see, Italy is. I mean, that yeah, they're, they have stalled our advance. Well, Stalingrad. I'm pushing the Americans out of here. This is, uh, yeah, there's a whole uh, slog right now. I'm trying to thicken the lines a bit. Come on, just force them out. There we go. So we deal with this pocket. King of Italy's capitulated. Uh, wait, that leaves a lot open actually. Uh, dude, just stop pushing in. Come on. Movement on the Italian front. Who'd have thought there will be no Yalta conference today? Oh, God, there might be. Sevastopol's <laughs> kind of guarded. Let's see if we can push into Italy. Oh, my God, we can. <gasps> this front's broken, finally. I don't know why the Americans just never had any uh, military equipment. Like, ever. They've taken back Leningrad. I'm just going to keep right-clicking on it. That's it with 4,500 defense. I don't think we're going to take Leningrad, you know? Oh my god, NC Chief. You may be very proud of the drum rights. She'll truly stand for a thousand years. Did not kill the USA. Did not kill UK. Let Finland die. Did not occupy Vichy, France. Oh my god. Oh my god. 53. Jesus Christ. Oh. It, um, pieces out. Like, why peace out? <laughs> they get to keep it in my land. Oh, man. Well, there we go. Um, I will say a couple of things to note. Um, uh, I was on 0% logistic fulfillment the entire time. I don't think um, that the supply system was working as intended. I think I got very fortunate with that. Bear in mind, this is like an older version of, uh, of Hoi 4 um, mixed in with a... a so it's, a, it's always going to be a bit weird. But aside from that, frankly, I'm, I'm pretty proud of that. Um, that was a lot of fun. Uh, I'm gonna go lie down. That was been nine hours of Hoi 4. So I'm gonna go sleep now. <laughs> if you did enjoy it, please do make sure to like and subscribe and I'll see you all next time. Goodbye. Huge shout out to my Patreons. Most importantly, Redguard76, Lewis Wright, Ryan B, Atreides, Blenderman, Krilly, Ghostwolf, JDAL52, Xiaomi, Luke, Matthew McHugh, Mike473, Mikey Lewis, Original, Shadow Singer, and Tom. This support means a lot, guys. Also here, why not watch another video? I mean, it's it's right there. Just just click.